I don't think y'all are ready for this, and I don't know if I'm ready for this, but uh, we got a beaut right here. 97 Honda Accord with 105K on her butt. Good old V6. Hood struts. 1997. Pika Gander in here, and she is looking absolutely mint we got the tape player right cheer we got power windows power locks we got automatic windows sheesh most beautiful thing i've ever seen oh she's a beaut we got all them hubcaps on there get you lifted on up this is a pre-purchase inspection so we're just gonna Peek a little gander at her, bud. Lovely distributor right here. A little bit of a valve cover seepage. Ooh, we got a torn intake hose. All right, all right. Whole bunch of vacuum lines going on here. Peek a gander in here. Slightly murky. Uh-huh, okay. Transmount. It's looking good. I did power brake this and the uh, mounts are feeling good. Got one tucky tucked right here. That's looking real nice. Got triple belt set up. I don't think I've ever done one of these timing belts, so today might just be the day. Got the alternator and the power steering pump. Best friends up there in between the uh, V of the engine there. A little bit of seepage down there. And a little bit of seepage on that back valve cover. All right, okay. A little wish wash fluid. Flip you flip, first try. Yeah. Worm clamp on the radiator. Do not like that. Worm clamps are trash. Little tech tip for you, bud. And she's just looking outstanding. Peek a gander at this filter here. And uh, yeah, that's, that's torn pretty good. Yes it is, that's brand new. She is brand new. That's looking real nice. We're gonna tuck that back in there. Brand new battery. Let's uh, check them terminal ends. Beautiful, impressive, very nice. Okay. We got power steering fluid. We got your ABS module right here. And uh, yeah, a little bit of seepage from this output hose crimp. Not too bad for a 97. Let's lift her up. What are we working with? Some nines, eight, decent. Got over here, eight, uh-huh, it's real nice. How old are these boys? 2018. Poverty cover. That didn't feel good. A little rough. Some rough lug nut threads. Poverty cover. Exhaust tip still got a shine on them. Feel a little 
rough. They look a little rough. Noted. Poverty cover. It's his phone, all right. Uh, sir? There you go. All right. Poverty cover. Oh, too late. We're too late. I tried. Get some gloves on and check the brakes. Doctor, doctor, 12 cc's of sodium pentothal. It's uh, 14, I imagine. Yeah. Yeah. Come on out, Lassie. Show me what you got. Medium rare. That's a Buddha. Three millimeter to the sensor. You always want to measure the inner brake pad because that's the one that has this sensor that sticks out like two millimeters from the actual pad, so. Okay. That's. That's loose. That's not good. Oh yeah. That's uh, seized up in there. It sure is. Nice. Let's try to get a measurement here. So that's four, got three and a half, four, and a seized bolt. Oh yeah, that's cross-threaded into the slide pin. So that's nice. Gonna need a new slide pin and a bolt for you, bud. What do we got back here? Wow. 12 millis with no room to loosen them. Okay. Uh, what, what the hell? What the hell? This bolt is also sticking out. And probably cross-threaded. Fox sakes, bud. Huh. Interesting. Let's see if I can get at that. With a 12. Wobbly? No. One bolt. Two bolts. No need to freak out. There you go. There we go. What do we got here? That is a Buddha two and a half. Okay. That moves. That moves. Sneak you up in here. Why are you doing this to me, Honda? What is this? Is this a trap? This is uh, entrapment. And a 12 milli? Just kidding. That's a 12 milli. We got the tools. Don't test me here. Do not test me. Here we go. Go ahead and uh, get up off there, bud. <laughs> yeah. That's a Buddha three right chair. Three, two and a half. This uh, bolt is not in there all the way. 14, 14. 
What the hell's going on here? Oh yeah. That's not feeling good. Nope. That's some uh, caliper bracket thread damage for you, bud. Okay. Moving on. Very nice. Good movement there, bud. Swaby link. Decent. Decent. Axle booties. Looking decent. A little bit of a seepage going on here, bud. I know those valve covers are seeping a little bit, so probably a good place to start. Oh yeah, she's puking up there by the valve cover. Very nice. Give this little jingle jangle. Oh, it's feeling pretty good. Swaby bushings. Even the rack's looking good. This thing's a gem. Uh-huh. The smallest amount of play. Same with this side. Just a little bit. Not bad at all. Lots of wetness up there. Could be a oil pump leak, but it's hard to tell with them uh, valve cover leaks. So, missing some clippies here. Get you some new clippies, bud. Front struts looking mint. She's a beaut. Dang. Look at that swaby link. What the hell? What the hell is that? It's tight. Look at this little baby swaby bushing. That's cute as fuck. A little tear. All right. <sighs> Tell you what. <sighs> Tell you what, bud. She's looking pretty mint. We like this. We're liking what we're seeing here, bud. Good old Fram filter on you, bud. All right, I got that one bolt out of the caliper, and uh, yeah, she's she's toast. So, reckon a caliper bracket and a new bolt. Just need to check the tire pressures right quick. Thirty-two. Set her at uh, 35 five. Show me what you got. We like what you got. Nice. Like to set the pressures about two PSI over because we're in Colorado and it gets cold and it's about to be winter. Show me what you got. Very nice. Show me what you got. Very nice. Alrighty, back into your home, and we can drop her down. All right, just wanna peek one more gander at these leaks here. And there's a valve cover gasket here, and there's another little plate back here that has a gasket as well, so. I'm going to recommend to replace both of those gaskets. And uh, we got no oil up in there. That's good. Good sign. Very nice. Yep, it's looking good. So definitely the top valve covers are seeping a little bit. And uh, the bottom ones a little hard to tell, but uh, there's definitely wetness on the manifolds, so we're gonna replace both of them bitches. Peek over here. Cam plug looks dry. Very nice. Alrighty, 
final consensus here is she is an absolute gem. And uh, yeah, going to need uh, some new uh, brake caliper slide pins and bolts, but she's looking real nice. We have got the Rex in, and we are looking at a very gentle recommendation total of $5,600 for this gem. Coolant, brake fluid, trans, power steering, bunch of oil leaks, got the uh, rear brake situation, the front brake situation, torn intake boot, timing belt with oil pump reseal, and uh, yeah, that's about it. So, 97 Accord, total gem. Let me just bring this to your attention one last time. We got hood struts on a 97 Honda Accord, and they still work. Very nice. Simba.